Welcome Libras, I'm back y'all with another video. So this is gonna be for February, February 2021 y'all. So let's see what message we have for the Libra. All right, so if you are new to my channel, welcome in. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I would love to have you here with me guys. Go ahead and click the subscribe button as well as the bell so you won't miss out on future notifications, okay? going to be for sun moon and rising venus as well as north node all right so libra 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 what message are there for the libra if you're interested in booking a personal that information is in the drop box below Um, as well, if you would like to take a look at the website to see if you have any, um, I do sell handmade ritual oils and as well as spiritual pieces. So there's something over there that you guys can possibly benefit from. Just go ahead after this video, check out the website. Okay. All of that information is in the drop box below. All right. So let's talk to the Libra. Sun, moon, rise and Venus, North Carolina. Well, we got the Five of Swords here at the bottom of the deck. King of Swords, Knight of Swords, lots of swords, Six of Swords. What's going on? All right, y'all all up in your head about something. I'm getting like there's some type of thoughts, some negative thoughts. I feel like somebody could be mad or there's some type of hidden agenda or some jealousy going on. We got an older person and a younger person here. King of Swords, Knight of Swords. Let's see what's going on. Two of Swords. <laughs> Lots of Swords here. So just let me know that these are thoughts, okay? So some of y'all are just like all up in your head right off the bat. Knight of Cups. Three of Pentacles. Strength. Three of Swords, Seven of Swords, King of Cups, Star, Nine of Swords, and the Hermit. All right, so. Why is the Two of Swords here? I'm getting like y'all not responding to somebody, y'all not responding to someone's message or something like that, emails or something. Why is the two of swords here? Yeah, like you're not, you're not, either there's like, you're not sure if you want to be uh, together with someone or you're not sure if you want to be in a relationship but I'm getting somebody's rushing. Somebody is rushing out. Why is the Ten of Cups here? Knight of Wands. Okay, so I'm seeing like you saying, I don't want no on again, off again, no temporary relationship. Okay, so some of y'all are being patient. A lot of y'all are practicing patience. Some of y'all are not responding back. The messages. What's the Knight of Cups here? Ooh. Eight of Cups. Like, what are you doing messages? A lot of y'all are, like, not responding to the what you doing messages. And, mm -mm. It's like, mm, no. No. Yeah, because you don't want to have any regrets. You don't want to regret none of that later. Okay, why's the Five of Cups here? The Tower. Yeah, see, you don't want this to blow up in your face <laughs> at all. Could be dealing with the Scorpio. Knight of Pentacles, we got Capricorn's energy. 
Maybe you're surprised as well at how someone is taking uh, their sweet time to offer you something real and authentic. And you feel like it should be moving along a lot quicker than what it is, okay? Why is Chariot here? Yeah, some of y'all are ready to move on to something new or someone new because this person is just moving too it's too slow for you. We got the strength card. Could be dealing with the Leo. I'm getting somebody hating. You telling somebody to stop hating or somebody saying, somebody saying stop hating. Ten of Swords and the Five of Swords. This could be a little bit of conflict. I feel like you may feel like a Leo could be plotting against you. Um, you're tired of it. So you're ready to, you're in this mode. Like you're in defense mode. Like you're super, super in defense mode here. Why is the Ten of Swords in here? The Empress. Okay. This is the mother card, the baby mother card. This is Libra's energy as well, too. Mm-hmm. Queen of Swords. This is you guys' energy. Okay, so yeah. Somebody's walk, walked away or getting ready to walk away. This person could have broke your heart in the past. Yep, we got the lovers and the three of swords. Yeah, I feel like you took... You took a risk on this situation. You stepped out on faith. You took a leap. And you gave this person a chance. But this person could have possibly had you strung up in a third party situation. Or just like the love wasn't mutual. It was not mutual. Yeah, see. We got y'all over it. Okay, you feeling like it wasn't successful. Why is the seven of swords here? Seven of Swords for Future Energy. Then we got the Emperor. So we got the Empress and the Emperor here. It could be baby mother, baby father in energy here. Um, could also be like a older male. Why is the Emperor here? Somebody is telling somebody like they need to take responsibility for their issues. Somebody is extremely toxic. We got the Devil and the Five of Wands. Yeah, this is somebody who's extremely toxic, okay? Page of Swords and the Queen of Cups. You could be spying on a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. What has the devil here? Ooh, the Will of Fortune. I'm getting changed your rules, changed the game. So I'm getting that there's getting ready to be a shift. You're shifting the way you respond to someone because of their actions. Their actions are extremely toxic, okay? We got the King of Cups, could be a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. Temperance, okay? You're trying to balance your emotions. You're trying to keep your emotions balanced. Okay, and being honest with yourself and the truth, okay, of the situation. You're trying to stay balanced emotionally. And that's you standing your ground. That's you standing your ground because you are keeping yourself emotionally balanced. Now, we got an Aquarius energy over here, Leo's energy over here. Oh, the moon and the queen of wands wants to jump out. I'm getting a lot of secrecy here. There's some somebody here that's in the dark. This person could have waited to tell you the truth because they felt like you were going to get offend, get offended. Why is the moon here in the Queen of Wands? The world, okay.
I'm getting like they feel like you were gonna make a big deal, so they wait. They're waiting, or they waited to tell the truth. See what you what you're fearing is worrying about this situation and holding, trying to hold on to this connection. Okay, and this connection is just a mess. It's too toxic. Somebody here keeps bringing up the past. And, you know, I feel like you're afraid to uh, kind of like let this situation go or you're afraid to continue to hold on to it. Because I feel like yeah, some of y'all are still trying to hold on to it. But at the same time, feeling like you need to go because somebody's energy here is extremely toxic. Like somebody got some toxic ways. Why is the Hermit here? You could be dealing with the Virgo. Um, or you are isolating yourself from this person. You could be ghosting this person. Yep, the Six of Swords. I feel like y'all are about to ghost somebody. Yep, you're going to make them miss you. Mm -hmm. And I feel like somebody was listening to their friends and getting game and all of that, playing the game, um, getting uh, advice and stuff from their friends. You about to make them see what it's like. Why is the Six of Swords here? Nine of Cups. You about to get your wish fulfillment. Yep. Some of y'all, uh, a new person is getting ready to come in. But the thing about it is, is when this new person comes in, I feel like the best thing for you to do is keep it private. Keep it private. Yeah, see, nine of wands and the three of cups. I feel like I'm getting, like, somebody got somebody watching somebody. Or somebody is listening to hear say, she, he say, she say. Okay. Yeah, because, see, somebody's waiting to see what somebody's going to do. I'm seeing that as well, too. So that's the message that I got for my Libras. All right, if this message resonated with you, make sure to leave me a thumbs up. Let me know what's going on in the comment section below. And I'm going to chat with y'all on another day. Ciao for now.